Hi, I'm Joe Sanborn with Behringer, and I'm here today at worldmusicsupply.com. And I'm going to talk to you about a couple of products from Behringer. We have the uh, BCF 2000, which is what I'm going to be talking about, as well as the BCR 2000, which uh, we'll be doing in a separate video. But I'll show you how the two uh, interconnect. The BCF 2000 is a, uh, a control surface. I want to talk a little bit about the way the, uh, the BCF uh, 2000 connects to the computer. Um, has a standard USB connection on the back. It also has a MIDI in and an out A and an out B or a through. And it also has a, uh, a couple of jacks for foot switches, which uh, we'll talk about in a second. If you're just using a single unit like this, you would just use uh, your USB straight into your computer. Um, but this is a, the type of device that you can use in many different applications. Um, you might have a MIDI rig where you're not going to use um, any of the USB connectivity and you would just want to use it as a, a MIDI controller for con controlling synthesizers or sound modules or effects processors. In the configuration I have today, um, I have it going through USB to, uh, to my laptop. And uh, in this configuration, the MIDI jacks on the back actually turn into a fully functioning MIDI inter interface. Uh, getting to some of the, the various uh, functions on the top, there's eight motorized faders, as well as the fader moving when I uh, move it on the, uh, on the actual unit. If I'm in the computer and I grab a fader, you know, it's uh, controlling. You can see the, the motorized fader action. Um, so we have these uh, faders. Like I said, they're, they're assignable for a, a bunch of different functions. Over on this side of the unit, we have four switches which can be assigned to anything we want. These left and right uh, preset switches allow me to basically make different configurations of all the different buttons on the unit and then store them into presets. Over here we have our various um, editing mode buttons and it's very very easy to, uh, to program or to override or to make new, new presets um, using this interface. Up here we have basically a set of um, eight encoders with, with LEDs, so they show us the, uh, the position where we're at. And these encoders also have a second function, which is fully programmable. Just by clicking the encoder, we could set this to a different function. These eight encoders actually turn into 32 encoders because we have four banks. So if I switch to the different banks, each of these encoders, you'll notice, is switching to the different uh, function of what I have these assigned to. Eight encoders uh, times an encoder and a switch is 16, times four banks is 64 um, different possible combinations of assignability on these um, encoders. This bank of uh, switches down here, you can uh, basically assign these to any, any MIDI function that you want or any you know, function within the software. So a very, very functional uh, unit, very assignable. It's a great piece of gear. So this is the uh, BCF 2000 um, from Behringer. And uh, you can find uh, this Behringer product and many other Behringer products at worldmusicsupply.com.